Squire Affinity Telecaster, Fender American Professional 2 Telecaster. Is there really any difference? Hey, James G here with Tarpley Music in Fort Worth, Texas. But remember, you can always find us online at tarpleymusic.com. And please, if you haven't already, please subscribe to our channel below. It really helps us out and it helps us get a lot of great feedback and from the comment sections and so forth. So you're interested in getting a certain type of guitar. You go into a guitar store, you see two of them that look very, very similar, but one is five times more than the other one. And you're thinking, is there really that much difference? This is a question I've heard a lot over the last several years as both a player and a salesperson for guitars, and it's a fair question. Um, is there a difference? Of course, absolutely. Otherwise, we would just make inexpensive, <laughs> inexpensive guitars. But no, of course there is a difference. Um, now, what I can't explain in a video or what I can't make you understand in a video is how it physically feels in your hands. The details of how frets are, you know, maybe they're not that sanded down and if they're getting into your hands here, how it literally just feels. Um, you, you can feel when something feels real solid in the way it's made in your hands. Um, but a lot of the specs are the same, but not all the parts are. So in these two tellies, we have, you know, it's a 9.5 radius. It is a maple neck with a maple fretboard. Very similar. Of course, the style of the guitar is the same. Both have two pickups with three-way switch, okay? Now, the body on the Affinity Squire, this is a poplar body. You're gonna get either like a roasted pine or an alder, depending on the color, on the American Pro 2. The bridge is very different. This is a six saddle, uh, bridge style setup here. In the American, you have get the actual T-style three-way brass, which you would see in the original tellies. Um, this is a synthetic bone nut. You get a real bone nut in the American. And of course, the pickups, totally different. These are very basic ceramic style pickups. The American Pro, you're getting the actual American Telecaster wound pickups. Um, so yeah, there is definitely a difference. The last difference uh, I can explain, but you can't feel unless it's in your hands, is that these are these are uh, medium jumbo frets, uh, which are usually for more beginning players to get sound out of, and then you got narrow, tall frets in the American Professional too. So those are the physical characteristics difference, the wood differences and things like that, but how does it sound? Now, there's definitely a sonic difference. There's definitely a sound difference. So what we're going to do is we're going to run both of these guitars through the exact same sequence of things, uh, playing very similar type parts, and so you can hear the differences for yourself. So how I have everything hooked up is both guitars are plugged into an AB switch box, going from one to the other, uh, into a Super Overdrive SD1 that will add overdrive in here in a few minutes, and then going right into the Fender Deluxe Reverb Amp direct out of this into the interface. Now, whether you love that sound or not is irrelevant. I want to keep it consistent so you can hear the, the changes between the two guitars. So I've got treble and bass at about six, uh, volume is at about two, and then the reverb set at about three. So I'm gonna leave that completely the same. Both guitars are all the way up in volume, all the way up in tone. And uh, I'm gonna start here with the neck position and I'm gonna swap guitars. So here's the affinity. switching over to the American Pro 2 sitting in the same position. All right. So now we'll switch to the middle position on the affinity. Switch it over to the American Pro 2 in a middle position. Except I gotta do the switch. All right, switch.
switching back. Now we're going to do the bridge pickup on both guitars. So here is the bridge on the Affinity Squire. Bridge pickup on the American Pro 2. Alright, like I said, the one aspect that this guitar has in the middle position, so I can push this button here, it's actually running everything in series. Alright, so now I've got the same setup, except I'm going through a Boss Super Overdrive, the SD-1, which is just a great budget overdrive. Um, just adding that into the mix. I'm going to play through all posi three positions in the Squire, and then we'll play all three positions, actually all four, in the American Pro, so you can hear the differences from there. Here we are. <laughs> to the American Pro. And here it is in the exact same sequence. Pro, we do have the fourth setting, so we're going to go to the middle, push that in to play the pickups in series. <laughs> So there we have a very simple demo of both of these guitars being plugged into the exact same situation. Uh, and me halfway playing the same lick, right? <laughs> so, um, and it's this is, like I said, it's subjective. I'm not going to say one way or the other, but there are those tonal differences that are between these guitar two guitars. Now, like I said, the thing that I definitely cannot explain uh, on a video is how much better this one feels, how smooth the neck is. I don't have any issues. Quite honestly, the Affinity, I had to tune several times during the video. Um, this one, I did not. It just sit there the whole time. So those kinds of things um, also, but from just a listening standpoint, can people say, is there really much of a difference? Well, you be the judge of that from what you heard. We'd love to hear any comments one way or the other if you'd like to leave us one. And if you've got any more versus uh, guitars ideas that you might like to see, uh, just let us know and we'll see if we can get around to filming those for you um, because it is a very interesting thing to do sometimes just to see. Is there really a difference? Well, I think there's a massive difference. That is my opinion. Of course, I'm also the one playing them, so it is much different from that standpoint. But I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you uh, got a little um, understanding of really from one guitar to the other, why is it so much more expensive and things like that. And uh, if you enjoyed this video, I'd really appreciate it if you just hit like for us, subscribe to the channel, channel so you can watch more videos as we uh, drop them weekly and if you turn on notifications you'll be notified every time we do so hit that turn on notifications we'll see you on the next one